The GSLP election team was put to the party membership at a meeting last night at the John McIntosh Hall and was ratified near unanimously, with 400 votes in favour, one against and two abstentions. Party leader Fabian Picardo is rejoined by Gilbert Licudi, Joe Bossano, Samantha Sacramento, John Cortés, Albert Isola and Paul Balban. The GSLP Liberal Alliance registered for the election in Parliament this morning. Among them was the one newcomer, Vijay Daryanani, who was selected by the Liberal Party's Executive Committee last night and joins Joseph Garcia and Stephen Linares. Mr. Daryanani contested the 2000 general election with the alliance, making this his second electoral run. This is the strongest team that is being presented to the public in Gibraltar. It's the team that is tried and tested, renewed with Vijay Dalyanani, who has been a candidate before, who is the voice of Gibraltar business, the voice of Main Street, the voice of Gibraltar as well, coming into the liberal part of the slate. This is the team that can deal with the clear and present danger that is Brexit. We have dealt with the issues that Brexit has presented already. We have the relationships, not just with the politicians involved, we have the relationships with the officials in London, London, in Brussels and in Madrid, who are going to be key players in delivering on Brexit, either on the 31st of October or in any other date. This is the tried and tested team. It's the right team for this very difficult moment in our history. Meanwhile, Samantha Sacramento remains the one woman on the GSLP Liberal slate. But Mr. Picardo said it was about choosing the people who will run Gibraltar, not casting a diverse Hollywood movie adding his party had turned down other great male and female candidates in favour of what he termed the strongest team in the election. Look, we would want to have the best people for the job at this time. The team that was chosen in 2011 has been renewed. It's been renewed because since 2015 we've been dealing with Brexit. This must not be about your colour, your race, your profession or the dangly blitz that you have. Let's be very clear, we're choosing the people who are going to run Gibraltar. Look, do I wish that we had a perfect gender balance of five men and five women, all the, the uh, religions represented? Well, look, if I was setting out simply to confect a team, I might do that. That's not what this is about. This is reality. Fabian Bigardo said people need to avoid flights of fancy and manifestos full of fairy tales, at what he described as the most challenging time for the rock since the frontier closed. He argued it was his team alone that had demonstrated the ability to keep Gibraltar going in these difficult times.